On this one, I think it sounds bigger than the toms, yeah. It's just an experiment. I've been dicking around with it. I want to see if it sounds like the real Then we'll roll one. I think this I think this song is a monster. So are you are you getting the A then? Yeah, yeah. All I'm doing is just not picking the A. You know, it's been an interesting ride from the beginning of what is now The Conspirators. I've been playing with Slash for going on four years now. Got a last minute phone call. Could you be at Mates in North Hollywood tomorrow at noon? And I was. So this guy Todd comes down to the studio and uh, when he started playing, there was that instant synergy that happened. Long story short, about a week later we were on Jay Leno, Craig Ferguson, all these TV shows, and uh, I've been there ever since. As a bass player, it's sort of like being like the ambassador between the guitar player and the drummer because you're really kind of playing both sides. You have to have that groove going, but you also have to be playing in key and in tune with the musical aspect of it as well. With guys like Slash who are very creative, my job is to kind of help sort of spurn that along. It's just all about supporting the team, you know. That's cool. It's not bad. I mean, I can totally hear you doing the doing. I'm listening for it now. I'm trying to imagine. Oh, oh, yeah. oh I see what you're saying. To the, have the guitar do that. Have the guitar do that. Interesting. Sorry, I was still on the screen here. What song is for? Once the drums are finished, we sort of reset up the room so that the amps themselves, they're all sort of, you know, boxed in depending on how you want to catch sound. There's blankets over top of things and whatnot to uh, just capture each individual sound. In a more of a digital world, the DI sort of capturing a, a direct sound and then playing with it within the box. Um, and I'm not opposed to that. I've worked in that and I had a lot of great results in that world. Um, but in the conspirators, on Planet Slash, as I call it, we like to do things a lot more organically. For me, it's um, and for Slash as well. It's all about if it's coming out of your amp, and you like the way what's coming out of your amp, then 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 there's no need to fix it. Yeah, hi. Where are you sliding from? Yeah, I'll come out. From the right hey, hey brother, Daddy. how are you? Come on in. These guys are playing amazing. I mean, I've never seen Brent play the way that he's played on this record, and Todd is in here doing bass now and is just blowing my mind. And it's really raising the bar for me as well. My guitar playing has to be able to stand up to that and sit on top of it, you know? Some good shit in that one too, sir. Like the ending. All right, I have room not for the entire thing on here, but close. So let's do this. Let me switch reels real quick, and then we'll we'll do.